So what's going on, toxic gamers? Today, you have to stop rolling your fat doobies, guys. Uh, stop rolling, man. Because the energy that you're about to witness in this video, I don't even think you guys are ready for this one, okay? Because, of course, yeah, we had the BBC upside, right? Massive BBC upside. Massive BBC Samurai situation that is raging wildfires right now. But what, what else can I say, man? Today, we also got toxic gamers we got some of the most some of the best toxic gamers that there are out there in the gaming ladies and gentlemen like the video if you think there are two genders dislike the video if you think there are five thousand genders and i don't think you guys are ready for this one way I, I got a bunch of clips okay also i want to shout out all of you all of you guys out there you guys are absolutely killing it man shout out to all of you for liking subscribing following over on instagram as well if you guys do use instagram definitely uh, check out the link in the description in the pinned comment as well i would definitely love to have you there all right let's get to it man i don't think you guys are ready for this one uh oh shout out to the homie jazzerus jazzerus yeah jazzerus roll it Dango sun dies and concord proved me right and that is why i'm making this Wait video because people said i don't want to play like a fat ugly bitch with Caesar pro Pronouns. and you guys said if you don't like it don't play it <laughs> and people didn't play it and the game fucking died and it was Yo, a tra tranquilo papi tranquilo man i listen man like you guys are not even ready you know what i'm saying like you guys are not even ready Wait for sir, it, now you understand why it is so stupid to say <laughs> if you don't like it don't play it i am not saying that concord failed because of that <laughs> obviously it failed because the game sucked yeah but it is a it, it belongs in the garbage it, <laughs> it belongs in the garbage damn it any of my mexican homies i'm not sure if he's mexican or not maybe he is I, I listen man i don't know but everything that he's gonna say i'm just gonna put like a c right there okay yeah tell that to these putos out there to these pendejo out here i'm with you brother Found that, amigo. that people said if you don't like it don't play it and and you see that not playing the game and a lot of people not playing the game leads to the game dying because yeah. the most important yeah. thing is having people playing the game brother today is something <laughs> very common that when someone recommends a game to you you go and look how many players does this game has to yeah. see if it is worth it i mean the last time we checked it had like seven seven and then the app retired you know i said the app retired brother to invest your time in a game that is popular and is not going to die down so uh -huh. oh, a friend uh -huh. recommended a memo to me <laughs> and you go and look new world let's see how is new world doing and you see that it has less than 5k players and you say fuck this i am not bro 5k less than 5k players i mean you're not wrong but bruh like it even had less than 700 players <laughs> It could not break 700 people, at least on stream, at least on stream, at least on stream. Oh. In this, I am not investing my time in this because see, this see. is dying. See. Do you understand why it is important having a player base? I'm not pushing them back saying, yeah. if you don't like it, don't play it. Be yeah, that, that basically he's making fun of like everybody that, that says that don't like it, don't play it. So he's like, don't like it, don't play it. Nah, absolutely, man. I, I get Bruh. it though. And, and of course, Ubisoft, man. Ubisoft, guys. Everybody, like, give give a shout out to Don't Captain BBC. Salute to Captain BBC. This this is being made by Ubisoft out there. This thing is crazy, man. They always do that to black people, bro. Like always, man. They make they see a black guy and they're like that person gay. That black guy, that's gay, right? So they always do that to my black homies, man. I'm not sure if you guys uh, see that or not, but yeah, that's what's going on in gaming right now, right? But it's it's true. It's true don't like it don't play it that's what they said and gamers have took it literally they're like hey we don't like it so therefore we're not gonna play because they are trying to improve the game with constructive key <laughs> Because they are trying to improve the game with constructive criticism, brother. You can like something brother. as a whole, but have some parts of it that you don't like that you want to see improve. I like WoW, but I think that a lot of the hero talents suck dick. And I want them to see them improve. Does that mean that I hate the game, that I shouldn't play it? No. It's, <laughs> it's like what? It's like D? Okay, okay. All right. 
Damn, man, your puppy. Tranquilo, Habibi. Habibi, chill, Habibi. Habibi. Just means that I want this particular thing to be improved and I am going to bitch and whine about <laughs> it so they improve it. You yeah. don't have to like every single part of something, brother. For example, I am sure you have uh, family members or friends that you love with all your heart and they have some things that you don't like or you think that they should improve and that doesn't mean you don't love them brother are you understanding that is why i think that saying if you don't like it don't play it is for a stupid yeah. people that don't have foresight when someone says to me if you don't like it don't play it i automatically think that they are branded because they yeah. are incapable of bro let it all out okay let it all out one thing that I, I appreciate is that brother have like insane abilities to articulate. You know, he is able to articulate everything very, very well. Like this is this is this is guys, give it up, man. I better see you guys smashing likes. I better see you guys smashing subscribes on this one, man. Shout out to the homie Jazzrus, okay? Love this man. Living legend, living legend. This he's telling he's saying nothing but the truth here. He only speaks the language of the truth. And, and yeah, these games do suck dick, man. These games are beach, like these who do suck dick, okay? Uh, but yeah, he is speaking nothing but facts. Visualizing a future where people listen to them. Yeah, I'm also visualizing the future too, brother. See, see, see. And they don't play it, and the game dies down. Mm. And then the thousands of dollars they spend in ridiculous skin for their disgusting waifus are evaporated because the servers are shut down and the company declares bankruptcy. And then they lay off 500 employees, and one of those employees goes to Twitter to write that. Gamers suck yeah. and that is what the game dies down and then they blame Asmongol because he found them for 15 videos talking about how the game is shit and they are incapable of thinking that it died because of them because yeah. they push people out. Damn man, like damn bro, like d -Sec is crazy bro, like holy crap man, d -Sec is doing all this crap to raise gamers blood pressure out there, damn man. Damn man, d -Sec is really crazy and I'm trying to keep my my energy low today. Normally I have that high energy too, but I'm keeping it low because, you know, there needs to be a balance. Equilibrium, ladies and gentlemen, you know, yin and a yang, right? Because if he's like firing from all cylinders, I need to be the one to chill. The next clip that I want to show you right after, it's going to be quite chill. So I'm going to exaggerate, okay? I'm going to bring my energy up too. But for this one, we need to... Keep it simmer down. Away simmer it with down. their bullshit. That is why saying yeah. if you don't like it, don't play it. It's a stupid, yeah. you a stupid motherfucker. Yeah. Fuck! <laughs> I am going to get a heart attack, brother. <laughs> this, this isn't possible, my dude. Bro, there are no three words in the don't English do it. language more harmful. Then don't play it brother i always say i, I want to be loved i i i am a christian man yeah. i always want to show love but this is like a trigger for me <laughs> like you know that game dustborn that is also a bullshit game that yeah. they said when you say something as L listen man like uh, we as gamers we just want to we just want to show love man we just wanna... stop the cap nah, nah, seriously we just want listen man hand on top of this bottle of water man we just want to show love man we just want to show love bro the, yeah, bro, how many times a game comes out that's like not even 10 out of 10, but gamers are like, that's, a, that's 10 out of 10, man, that's 10 out of 10. But also, the opposite also true, right? If the, these uh, sick is gonna <laughs> disrespect gamers, then of course gamers gonna give it like 0 out of 10. Gamers gonna be like 0. You know, that also happens, right? But gamers are the... the <laughs> <laughs> Yo, okay, listen, man. These things are breaking gamers down right now. I am truly sad to see my people, my brother, my brothering, looking and feeling like this, bro. Can we just get good games, man? Is that is, like, like, damn, bro? Like, damn, why y'all suck is doing this, man? Y'all suckers are so racist towards black people, so racist towards Asian people as well, man. And damn, y'all suck is so racist towards brown people. You don't even put brown people in the game. Y'all suckers are always like, hey, inclusivity, inclusivity, diversity, diversity, diversity. But it's like, bruh, like, we, we don't even get diversity, bro. Like, where, where's my diversity? Where's my representation at, bruh? 
Damn, this like is crazy, bro. Uh, obviously, I'm joking around. I don't. I'm not dying for representation. But it's like they always say inclusivity, inclusivity. But we're not even seeing inclusivity, bro. We're not seeing inclusivity. We're not even seeing diversity. If you question that, they they're like, hey, zero, zero diversity, zero inclusivity for you. Like, what the hell are we talking about, man? This just make good games, bro. Like back in the days, we were getting these games right. Now these like is gonna these like are nerfing the La Lara Lara Croft Burna. They're nerfing Lara Croft big time. Like check this out, okay? I gotta show you guys, man. Like damn, man. Like these like is crazy, okay? This is a Lara Croft uh, design. I know some of you would say this was also nerfed, but I mean she looked good. She looked good, right? Like what about the? And this is a new design, man. This is a new design. Oh shit! Oh, shit. Uh, although I'm hearing that this was like a microtransaction in Call of Duty about Lara Croft about Tomb Raider or something similar but but like I mean damn look at that bro do you want this or do you want that I mean <laughs> like this what's going on in gaming bro like I don't know man like they're purposely uglifying the video game characters right like lowering uh, graphics graphics sucks nowadays right stories are trash games belong in the garbage filled with microtransactions filled with DEI like damn what are we talking about man we had so many amazing games back in the 2010s and uh, around the 2010 eras, bruh, like gaming was the best, bro. I don't know what happened. See, but they say trigger. They, if you don't like it, don't play it. It's the trigger for me. Like someone says, oh, you are ugly, father, and I fucked your mother. Yeah, man, for sure, all is cool. They say, oh, you come for a third world shit hole and your accent sucks. That is true, my man. That is completely true. And then they say, hey, if you don't like it, don't play it. What the fuck did you say to me, motherfucker? And that is everything that I wanted to tell you today, guys. <laughs> Just saying that Concord proved my point. It is awesome when reality it, proves your it. concepts and what you are saying in your videos, bro. Wait for it. And that just happened. I said, saying this is a stupid. Reality proved it's me stupid, right. Yeah. It is awesome. It feels great. So I am also educating you so you don't say this anymore. Because this makes people look like an idiot, in my opinion. So Yo, Slushy, you're watching this video? I, I, I don't know why, but I assume that Slushy would be like this, too. Yo, Slushy, you're watching. Maybe this is your lost brother, man. And Jazzerus, if you're watching this, bro, this is an amazing video, bro. You are speaking nothing but facts, my man. You are... There are thousands of languages on planet Earth. And the fact that you chose to spit facts, I need to salute you real quick, man. Shout out to Jazzerus. Shout out to the homie. And I also got a shout out to the homie Yellow Flesh. Now, I'm going to up my energy because the homie... He has like a okay energy. He doesn't have he has low energy. He doesn't have like too high of energy Jazzerus that's like peak energy right there, but check this out. What happened with it. Concord? Concord was a catastrophic failure for Sony and apparently other developers are kind of a little worried that it could yeah. happen to them next yeah, 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 And yeah. the reason I'm talking about this is because apparently Bungie is a little scared after watching Concord go down like it did and it's apparently affecting they better be bro they better be of course like that's good that they are because but that's also tells me that if they're really scared of concord going down the way it did that tells me that these seconds were making some bad as well though yay like these seconds must have been i wish i could say psych right now but the way it's sounding like that these seconds were also getting ready to drop like a woke ass game a filled with dei microtransactions you know, bad storyline, trash us game, buggy, filled with um, crap in it, right? It's just like garbage game all around. Like, that's what it tells me that if they are scared, if they're scared because of Concord failed, I mean, listen, man, like, what are we talking about? Concord, bro, it's like bottom of the barrel, okay? Like, that's bottom of the barrel content, bottom, bottom of the barrel video game, right? So the fact that you are scared of that game failing what are we talking about does that mean that your game is gonna be similar to that what the hell why are you scared like what what are we talking man if you're scared that concord failed and you're next then man it's over that tells me everything about your game already like this tells me already that this game is gonna whatever they're working on was gonna be a flop marathon's development now this article there's a reason that it was planned for this year and slipped a whole year well yeah it is over it is over is it connected to that this is more of a coincidence marathon development is reportedly facing trouble at bungie there's a reason that it was planned for this year and slipped a whole year so it looks like this is actually a blessing for them uh, apparently uh sources according to this jason schreier guy who has me blocked by the way 
Uh, the sentiment oh, around oh, no. the game that he's heard is it's not great. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Eight. At it's least as of a few months ago. So things aren't going very good for this game. They delayed it a whole year. Hopefully for the better, right? But there's been development problems with this game apparently for a while. So it's been delayed. And that's probably to give it some really good polish. I don't even really know what this game is. The trailer, which came out a year ago and has 21 million views, not bad. Uh, doesn't really reveal much either. It's a nice you, you know what uh, the homie Jazzrus got to say to them? Jesus. And Concord proved me right. And that is why I'm making this video. Because people said, I don't want to play like a fat, ugly bitch with Caesar pronouns. And you guys said, if you don't like it, don't play it. And people didn't play it. And the game fucking died. And it was <laughs> well. There you go, man. Yo, uh, tranquilo, Habibi. Tranquilo, papi. Nice looking trailer. It's really all it is, just nice looking. They don't really show you any gameplay. I would like to see more on it. But like I said, apparently they're making changes to this game and everything right now. And Sony and Bungie are a little concerned that this could end up being a Concord failure. Yeah, and they're yeah. going to work hard to make sure that it doesn't happen. Oh, man, like this thing is crazy, bro. If they really think that this is uh, going to flop, just like Concord, man. What are we doing? Yo, what is Sony doing? Yo, PlayStation. What's up, guys? PlayStation Nation. What's up, guys? How you doing, PlayStation Nation? Like, what the hell? What is going on right now, man? Y'all suck is crazy for this one. Man, we never... Bruh, like, for the longest amount of time, guys, like, say whatever, but, like, PlayStation, for the longest, I guess even the Xbox fans would agree. Even the fanboys. I mean, maybe not the fanboys, but the fans, like, general fans, right? Like, PlayStation fans, Xbox fans, gaming fans would agree that yes sony practices are bad they're they're bad they're trash absolutely but games wise quality wise they were pretty good they were pretty good but what is going on right now what the hell is going on right now man like damn this like is crazy like this is xbox first of all like xbox went down that hill too right playstation absolutely like what are we talking about man Damn, this suck is crazy, and they they have something similar to Concord again. Well, I mean, we heard that Fair Games, right? That's gonna be Concord 2.0. People are giving it Concord 2.0. Apparently, this uh this next game, uh, this a uh, perfect pause right there, by the way. But apparently, this game that's being in development by Bungie, that's all. It's called Marathon. That's gonna be like Concord 3.0 or something. No. What? Yo, Sony, PlayStation. What? You suck is. Uh, uh, go uh, how uh, what in the world how do you go from making god of war uncharted games to some like concord marathon uh and, and fair games right that's the name uh that's yeah the trailer is out cgi cuts in is out and people call it a concord 2.0 how how yo i'm baffled right now bro i am baffled according to multiple sources bungie is considering a premium pay-to-play model for marathon priced at 40 dollars this has raised a few questions considering Sony's past attempt with Concord, the live service hero shooter that failed to gain traction and was shut down weeks after its release. Given Concord's failure and the saturated free-to-play shooter genre, has Sony learned anything from its past mistake? Much like the ill-fated Concord, Marathon was originally intended as a sci-fi shooter that would bring something fresh to the genre. However, changes have been made towards an extraction shooter model. Now the game will have a roster of different heroes with its own perks and abilities, turning them into classes. This is partially due to the new director, Joe Ziegler, who took over yeah. Bungie's project and implemented these changes. So... If this is going to be some kind of a hero shooter, you really are in a tough market. <laughs> what will help this game are two things. One is Bungie. <laughs> Bungie has a built-in fan base still. That Joe Ziegler guy can suck uh, Jazzrus dick, man. Like, that's as J uh, Jazzrus would say. Destiny 2, Bruh. despite people complaining about it that still play it, they still play it. And, you know, you, of course, have Halo. But really, a lot of those people aren't even there anymore, I don't think. But they still have yeah. the Bungie name. Yeah. So the game is going to get positive attention. Just the fact that it's Bungie, I mean, this trailer having 21 million views on it, let's be real, that's because Bungie is attached to it. The mm -hmm. name mm -hmm. has some prestige, though. Yeah. So, a lot of people... Uh, and the like-to-dislike ratio is actually very good. But I guess it's concerning because they are now worried about Concord failing, much like the ill-fitted Concord Marathon was originally intended as a sci-fi show, or uh oh that would bring something fresh to the genre. <laughs> oh man, y'all suckers can kiss my BBC, man. Y'all suckers can suck my BBC, bro. I'm a brown guy, so I have a brown version of the BBC, guys. But but like but Bruh. but but you know what I'm saying? Like like these suckers crazy. The fact that you are scared 
of Concord failing, man, it is over. It is over for video games. I, I think it's gonna get worse before it gets better. I just hope that these suckers don't touch GTSX, bro. Like, GTSX, that's the only game that I'm waiting for, man. Battle, The next Battlefield game uh, sounding, the leaks, the confirmation, the news that is going around sounds kind of good. It sounds kind of good. But doesn't it always sound good, right, before launch? Does it, doesn't they all, do they, don't they always, like, hype it up? Don't they always say that it's going to be the best game, guys? Most immersive, biggest, baddest, you know, the craziest the 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 most what, what's the what's the term the we're gonna have some of the biggest landscapes or some bull squash like they, they always have those like marketing lines right next gen experience fully immersive the only thing that's immersive about these experiences is like the microtransactions essentially and the shop Bruh. right like exactly so the shop is always next gen the shop is always I'm talking about the microtransaction store in the game right those are the only ones those are the only uh, only things about the game those are the only mechanics of the game that are truly next gen and immersive are going to check this game out regardless because of the bungee name now the problem would be if they played this and they hate it and it ends up being garbage that would kind of bring that prestige of the bungee name down oh big i'm sure they're aware of that and i don't think it's just bungee that watched that concord failure and got nervous i think just about everybody in the gaming industry got worried after seeing that fail because i mean in a lot of ways concord is crazy because that's a sony exclusive Right, that's a Sony developed, published game. Sony owns Firewalk Studios, so that Sony muscle uh, resulted in nothing. It was a disaster. You can't just put that shit out anymore and expect some people to still play it. I mean, yeah. that game. I, I really still think that that game is probably the biggest disaster in the history of video gaming. It's under. It's so. It's such a big disaster. They lost easily hundred million. We heard that minimum. They they spent hundred million to two hundred million dollars. Uh, and the game couldn't even make a million dollars. So if you're gonna go off of these mats, then it's almost as though they have lost more than nine, 99 million dollars, right? And God forbids they spent 150 or 200 million US dollars. I'm talking US dollars, by the way. Then imagine, let's just say, let's just say on the, on the high end, they wasted uh, almost 199 million US dollars, bro. Like that is. Oh shit! Oh shit! just crazy man what are we talking about man what are we talking about man but guys take it easy man i'm sure like you guys have not lost 200 million us dollars am i right <laughs> check out this video on the screen this recently just happened insane drama surrounding mr beast dr disrespect and like the youtube scene right ksi logan paul insane drama check out this video on the screen if you already seen it then check out the video on the left man some good news apparently good news yeah man yeah crazy shocking good news